knows somebody who likes a certain drink more than all the others. Well, I like Dr. Pepper more than all the other ones. I know people who love Mountain Dew and all the other drinks, but I wanted to find people who like Dr. Pepper just as much as me. So I went on a journey to find them. But before I show you, here are some facts about Dr. Pepper. A pharmacist named Charles Alderton created Dr. Pepper in 1885 in Waco, Texas. Dr. Pepper is the oldest major soft drink manufacturer in the United States. Dr. Pepper has also made barbecue sauce, lip balm, jelly beans, and ice cream toppings. So here's Cameron Adler with the interview about Dr. Pepper. So Cameron, do you like Dr. Pepper? Nope. Uh, you're supposed to like Dr. Pepper because this is an interview about it. Nah. You're supposed to like Dr. Pepper? Nah, I don't. Why? Because it's nasty. What's so bad about Dr. Pepper? It's doctorish and pepperish and it's gross. So what is your favorite drink then, Mr. Mm -hmm. Non-Dr. Pepper? I don't know, maybe Pepsi. Anything that's not Dr. Pepper. What do you got against Dr. Pepper? Everything. What has it ever done to you? Everything. So Dr. Pepper isn't your favorite drink? No. So Disgusting. I'm, I'm just wasting my time interviewing people about Dr. Pepper. They're supposed to like it. Yep. It's gross. So what would convince you to like Dr. Pepper, Mr. Eller? Nothing. Not even this nice, crisp $20 bill? Dr. Pepper's great. How much do you like Dr. Pepper, Mr. Eller? A lot. How many Dr. Peppers could you buy with an $80 bill? They don't if make they, $80 bills. If they had $80 bills, how many I don't know. could you buy? I don't know. Would you spend a whole $80 on Dr. Pepper? Nope. Why? I don't know. So, is Dr. Pepper your favorite drink now? Mm, maybe. Is Dr. Pepper your favorite drink? Yep. <laughs> Well, that was Cameron Eller with the interview about Dr. Pepper, and as you can see, he really does love Dr. Pepper as much as I do. Thank you, Cameron Eller, for your time. Hope to see you in the future. I came across one of my old friends, Mr. Chewbacca. How you doing, Chewbacca? <coughs> oh, really? And uh, he was telling me before the interview that he does like Dr. Pepper, unlike my friend Cameron. But Cameron does like Dr. Pepper now, so there's no worrying about that. And... Uh, Mr. Chewbacca, on your many space journeys through the galaxy, how many Dr. Pepper cans have you came across? <coughs> Not many, because they don't have Dr. Pepper in space, in Star Wars space. <coughs> Chewbacca, it's your lucky day because I brought you an 8 foot tall Dr. Pepper can. And uh, for some reason it's been opened, but it still has some drink in it left. <coughs> You're welcome and thank you for your time. See you next week. So I've came across some some people in the Star Wars galaxy, and I came across Lord Sidious. How much do you love Dr. Pepper, Lord Sidious? It seems he loves Dr. Pepper so much, he's turned himself into one. Mr. Tusken Raider, how do you feel about Dr. Pepper? <laughs>